Hey chat, I'm back. What did we get? What are we doing? Oh, it's really close. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go with um, chat here on this one. I want to check out Runeterra and Arena. Very close though. Thank you guys for your contribution. That means I'm gonna guarantee to disappoint half of you right now, regardless of my pick. What an ideal spot to be in. But uh, let's check out Runeterra from those two. Meanwhile, all right, let's get that in. Your vote mattered. Nice. Now, to be fair, the majority sided with Filthy's goal here, so uh, maybe it mattered, maybe it didn't. All right, Rintera, feel free to pick up. There we go. Okay. All right. Use this token to play in an expedition. This is a. I guess I should update my title and update my game I'm playing. Just a second. Uh, what is this? Rin something of Legends of Runeterra? There it is. Okay. Um, okay. Black card games? I like card games. All right, and what happens with the long term? Long term is pretty close. Um, I guess I want this done. Okay, so where's the actual vote then here? Okay. Let's throw this up on Twitch, or not Twitch, Twitter, rather. And you guys probably can't hear volume because I'm tabbed out right now. I'll fix that in just a second. Okay. Meanwhile, let's check it out. Did we lose the vote? Half of you lost, half of you won. It's true compromise. So we go play. Expedition. We have not done one of these yet. We have two expedition tokens. Draft and build your deck. All right. Wait, what do you mean one? We have two. We got one yesterday. Give me that shit. It was in this reward, wasn't it? Do I just not claim this reward yet? Well, I claim that. We didn't use it last time, so what happened? I haven't claimed that. <laughs> the old have to click it for some reason. It's a passive thing that happens until you click it. Today Tuesday? Today is Tuesday, so I can claim this, right? Ready to claim. Okay. What the fuck is happening right now? Makes it more addictive if you click it. I take your word for it. I find it more annoying if I have to click it. That's the one I want, though. All right, so we have three arena tokens then to check this out with. See what it's like. Yeah, I, I, I believe you're probably right, Billy and Onia. Okay. Play. Expedition. Embark. Give them a token. New balance. Two tokens. Three tokens. Oh, you means after I've spent one? Does it really? It wants to do minus one math for me? Exciting. Okay. How do I draft it though? I guess I just click begin trial. Yeah. I begin to feel like a bit like a dog that's like run that's leash around the tree. My controller cord is blocking my headphone cord, which has been looped once in the wrong way. And just shortening that cord is starting to like do this a bit. Go. Okay. Alright, let's begin trial. Hmm. 
one of 15 champion pick. Laurent. Is this a champion? Or is this two? No, okay, so this is... So this is the first pick, and it's a champion pick, and I get to pick between essentially three champions, Garen, Karma, or Katarina. We haven't seen this one. Round N, create a random spell in hand. Level up your enlightened. Can I right click to see what it does? Yes. You can't play a spell, cast it again on the same targets. Okay. So I think for us between, um, that's okay too, I guess. But I think for us between these two, Katarina and Karma, I guess it comes with other stuff, so I should probably read what the other stuff is. Two. That's interesting. When it swings, get a reduction in cost of your hand for a two drop. That seems pretty decent. And this is a, I liked this card, the Shadow Assassin. So those all seem pretty good. Give my supported ally quick attack this round. That also seems pretty good. Two for a three, two. Wait, the straw pole isn't the real pole. Um, straw what? We had a pole for today for the, what we're playing this afternoon. And we had a pole for kind of a longer term. The straw pole is longer term. The in channel pole was for today. Um, I don't really like this. Grant other allied legion marauders everywhere. Plus, one. oh, I guess in deck two everywhere. That's okay too, I guess. Although if, we, if only one of them it seems less, I think I would take this one given my own. But you could talk me into Katarina if you guys really wanted. Get a preference here. Garen or Karma. No Katarina. All right, let's add this to deck. Done. All right, another champion pick. All right, so this is our second defining champion. So we have a two drop, a three drop, and a five drop, and a lot of um, late game stuff. This dude is very expensive. Haven't seen this. Three allies die. It's fearsome. Fearsome has to be blocked by late game cards. Levels up. The strongest dead allied follower. Okay. Neat. Seems okay. Tyrant Deer is always two for one, sure, but it's slow as fuck. It's an eight mana card and a six mana card, and we already took a late game hero. Do we need another late game hero? What does this one do? Twisted Fate. Play a Destiny card. Level up. Play. Play a Destiny card. Level up when you see when you draw eight plus cards at four mana two two. Ew. This is this is hard for me to parse what the fuck's going on with this. I assume these are destiny cards. I don't really know. I'm probably between Callista, which seemed fine. Okay, I guess I should look at their summons. Uh, Legion summon a Mistwraith doesn't seem great. Well, I don't know, actually. What does this ability do? When you summon this, it gets its allegiance bonus if the top card of your deck matches its region. I don't even know what that means. Top card of my deck matches Shadow Isles, then we get another one. We get a Mistwraith, which is slightly weaker, actually. Okay, that seems kind of shit. 
for a draft deck. To play me, kill an ally. Zero mana three. This seems pretty bad. Her supporting cards seem kind of bad. Deep was fine. Like if I'm, I think it's if I'm like low on cards, it's like bigger. For four, five mana, four four elusive. Give me a mana for spells when I cast it. That seems fine. I didn't like these. That was fine. I would take Twisted Fate here. Hello, Xanabu. It's your birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Thanks for spending part of it with me. All right, let's grab Twisted Fate. All right. Synergy pick. All right, let's see what we get. So we got a two, a three, a four, a five, and a... F uh, what? Okay, this is a weird way to break us down. So these are the same mana cost, but it's just telling me I have one of each. Okay, there's my curve bottom. Okay. To play me, discard two. Attack two. Draw two with fleeting. Seems bad. It's four five for four though. I already have one of these slippery wave riders, I think. Cost two less if you cast two plus spells last round. Draw two other spells. Meh. It's like I don't know what this red thing is. That regen. Four mana two two. That does what now? Life steals. Five mana, four, five. Overwhelm and regeneration seems pretty solid. Two mana, three, one with overwhelm and tough. I'm on this. I'm taking raiding party. All right. Feral Mystic. Enlightened, I have four plus four. What is it? 10 max mana. So late games. This is a two drop that gets better late game. It becomes a 6 6. That's pretty powerful. I liked that card. I think I already have one, right? <clears throat> well, presumably factions are just faction synergies. I'm not expecting to hit so many faction synergies in Arena. Maybe that's wrong, but. At the moment, like there hasn't been a lot of payoff for being the same faction. Summon a random one cost follower from any faction. Meh. This is the generating card one. Strongest enemy vulnerable. Don't know vulnerable. The enemy can challenge this unit, forcing it to block. Just anyone can challenge it? I see. Two mana, two, three. And another beast below. I think I would take this. Seems just better. I did tweet that I switched games, I think, Billy. Oh, maybe I didn't. Damn, I just tweeted out a poll thing. I don't want to spam people with that. I, I think that's a good idea in general, Billy. I guess maybe I will today. Try not to be spammy in the future. All right. Thanks. I do need to use that more. So I try not to fucking spam people, but we'll see. All right. Meanwhile, I think I'm on this right now. All right. More of these. Probably not. Although I do like the elusive assassin that draws me one. I'd like some direct damage. Golden Narwhal. Don't know this. It's vulnerable. It's a three mana, two, four elusive that's vulnerable, so other people can challenge it. That doesn't seem very good. It seems kind of bad, in fact. This thing seems okay, though. This is the. We already have one of these, right? The Scar Maiden Reavers. They seem like a very solid unit to me. I've done a fair amount of early game. I don't know how many cards we end up with, with 15 with three each. Presumably, I end up with 45 cards. I don't know if that's actually true. I guess these are not three each. It's three, then three, then two for the rest of them. So that's two 13s for 26, and then two threes is 28. It seems low. I 
I don't hate these. I don't know if I want a third green looking though. This is not a very powerful unit long term. So I think hey not rook. Yeah, I haven't played this game yet. Kind of kinda of, had a lot of fun with it the other day. I had a sponsorship for it and had a fairly enjoyable experience with it. Gonna check out the arena portion of it. I'm on this again. Let's take the narwhal and the scar the scar maiden. Alright. I uh, don't like that particularly. What's this? What does this stat do? 1-1. One, one. It's very aggro. Draw a champion. Kind of neat. Frostbite an enemy. What's frostbite? Doesn't seem very strong on a creature, but maybe. Kind of like this. You like cutthroat? Not super exciting on cutthroat. Let's try these. We're gonna be, it's inevitable we're gonna pick really terrible cards until we've played more, so we'll live with that. Slate a hand, draw a random non-champion from the enemy hand. Draw a random non-champion from the enemy hand? I just take a card? Oh, I like that. What's the plunder mechanic again? If I hit them, and draw cards from the enemy deck. It's interesting. Four mana, two two life linker. I haven't seen a direct damage spell yet though, which is getting me a little bit worried. Two mana, three two that gives them snow hair. One mana, one one. Frostbite invulnerable. That's pretty powerful too. This means I can trade with something and kill it. Create another random spell in hand. Create two instead. What was enlightened? 10 mana? I think I'm between raiding party and frozen solid here. I do like the idea of stealing resources from my opponent's hand. Oh, it's only a plunder though. I can't, it doesn't do anything without it. Ah, so I have to have dealt damage. It's less good. All right, let's take Frozen Solid. Draw a unit with five power. Do I have any five power units? Not yet. Double attack. Is that... <laughs> it's double strike! We got a double striking fucking six mana four six. It's interesting. I don't need really want another look out, I don't think. Salvage. Toss two, draw two. Toss is this discard. And obl obliterate an X non champion card from the bottom of your deck. Seems worth. And a five mana seven seven that summons them the narwhal thing this thing maybe i think i've taken these i mean this might be okay too though this gets better as a later pick i haven't seen any direct damage which is which is disturbing me the four six double strike is very good yeah, I'm a little worried about three of these. I don't really care. We'll try it and see. Grant all enemies vulnerable for six mana, six five. Granted damage ally plus three plus three. Five plus power. Frostbite enemies with three or less health. I think we're on this for some instance. What does a tune mean? So this is a one two that gives me a spell mana cost and a random one cost spell. I don't know how many one cost spells there are. Summon me from hand once you played two spells this round. It does not seem very good. I don't have a lot of spells. 
We passed Hunting Fleet before, maybe we take it. I don't mind uh, Beast Below either. Seems like a decent ability too. Plus three, plus three is a powerful effect for a four mana three three that gives another guy plus three, plus three and overwhelm seems okay. I don't really know that I need another two drop right now. I think I'm gonna take this. Plunder, I transform into Stormclaw. So he's a four six for five that transforms into a six six for five that other allies of five plus power have overwhelm. It's okay, I guess. Frostbite an enemy at instant speed seems nice. Deal four damage to enemy if it has zero power. Otherwise, frostbite it also seems nice, although it's slow, so it's not an instant speed. Kind of on this, I think. Have some instant interaction would be nice. Lure of the depths. Reduce the cost of sea monster allies everywhere by one. Draw a sea monster. How do I know if it's a sea monster? Because it says sea monster on it. Ah, cunning! We have two. Okay. So this would be three mana, reduce two cards in our deck by one, and draw one to hand. So draw a card again. Grant an ally plus eight plus four. Lol, lol, lol. Seems hilarious. Uh, surprise, you're dead. Last breath, draw one. Two mana, two one that replaces itself. Seems kind of nice. Plunder, get an extra mana gen. Is that every time? So every time I do damage to them? No. It's just if I cast it. We can ramp. I think I'm going to take this. Alright. Um, those cards are both seem really bad. 7-6, Overwhelm. Do I need more finishers in my deck? I'm not sure yet. I'm on this. Let's try that. Scales of the Dragon. Dragon protection in hand, which is kind of okay, but kind of bad. Call an ally to summon a living shadow in its place. I don't hate that. Seems like a nice little trick. It's okay as well. It's an enraged yeti. One mana one two is pretty shit. Gives me two one mana five fives. I have to draw them. I think I need more card draw for that to be good. Let's take the shadow shift. I don't know what this means. Your deck. Oh, I can trade out cards. Trade pick. So I can trade the Green Glade Lookout for a Ruthless Raider. Probably okay with that. Trade the Feral Mystic for an Alpha Wild Claw. I, don't I? I don't. I thought I picked an Alpha Wild Claw. How does it sort these? Looks like cost. Horn of the Deep. I didn't get one of those, huh? Card looks good to me. Shatter doesn't seem great for a Razor Scale Hunter. What is Scout? The first time only Scout units attack each round, ready your attack. I would like to get rid of that. But I want to get rid of this. This one seems fine. So I guess I'm getting rid of Shatter for this dude. Yeah. Alright. Let's go ahead and play. Select. Okay, next win. Okay, play. Play! 
All right, let's check it out. So we got no direct removal. That kind of sucks. I don't know what his things do. Nor will we ever know. All right, uh, that's probably a bit much right now. The Raider seems good at a starting draw. I'm okay with this. Something a little lower, maybe. That's okay. Let's keep this. Okay. Uh, sure, shout to you. Seven mana Yeti in hand. Rip. He's going first. Opponent went first. Give me a sweet button. Heightens the senses. I'll show you how it's done. All right. Let's see if we can trip him up with this dude. So summon this. This land is ours. Then get an attack off. He doesn't summon. We'll see. Made a 2-2. Two -two. What is Mushroom Cloud? I don't know what a Poison Puff Cap is. I need to read if this is on defense as well. It is. So I think this is just a pass. Okay. Attacking with a 3 3. I have no. It's not true. There's Dragon's Protection. I don't mind trading this for that. It's not super exciting. But I think I want to cast a bigger creature. I'll take everything. Okay. Check the video settings. Drops in a minute. Okay. Take a stance and hold it. Finding details is my duty. All right. So my attacking turn. Got five mana, including spell mana. Don't really feel that much of an urge to attack right now. But maybe I'll attack with a 2-1, depending on what shows up. So that's a stacking effect that's interesting, so I can do it multiple times. Got a mushroom? What does that mean? Time for a leap of faith. Um, I think I want to attack with one. Do I want a frostbite here as well? Sure, this is worth here. It's such a clunky card, it's slow, right? Wait, I hit. I want to cast on that guy. No, not opponents. Hope I didn't just give up my turn here. I'm trying to buff it and then attack with it. Okay. Crab I saw today. Skywatch formation. I 
beg your pardon? Seems pretty advantageous for me right now. My guy lives. I caught debuff that. So I actually got really good value out of that plus zero plus three there because he didn't want to because he wanted to block it for some reason. Shouldn't he have just taken two there? Why trade off a creature? Who knows? This opens this up next turn. Can get in with two more attacks. Reduce the cost of my other cards. Seems fine. Could just attack first. What does it do when I have two at the same cost? Is it random? Heard there was a little fella asking for me. Five mana right now. This means I can force something to block, right? What is, um... So I can get a scout round in with an attack as a 4-4, four, four, force him to block with the 3-3 three, three if I want, and then attack with my other units. I've always been a fun guy. Let's put three more poison things. I don't really know what these poison things do. Got hit for in the face with a million elusive damage apparently. Okay. Alright, so we definitely want to go to scout combat before anything else. Swing quickly, little fish. thing there it's recalling my unit so if I now replace it with the living shadow which is a 3-2 breaks his spell and kills his unit still or no just happened he just retargeted his spell after he cast it how the hell did he get to do that I didn't think he could retarget spells once they were cast we swim within the flows of magic I would really like that explaining so I don't know what the hell just happened Need to play this, I don't have a mana for it too. That's kinda of bad. Getting wrecked at the moment. Alright, um I can't block his elusive creatures is the issue here. Four mana only. ton of cards in my hand, but I'm losing on the board pretty heavily right now from that. Help? Oh, I didn't think about the fact that he's still vulnerable. I thought that was a one-time effect. Yeah, I should have done that. You're right. Should have attacked with the 4 to enforce that. What do these mushrooms do? I 
whenever I draw one, I take one damage. Okay. So I've got seven. Can't play a unit while spells are being cast. Sure, okay. Should be my turn now, though. Runaway bike. Walk softly, strike quickly, sweep them away. Dude, another fucking removal here on my card. Alright, I'm fucked then. I can prevent the damage, but I can't prevent the attack with this, right? I can ghost block? How? What you mean by ghost block? They grow up so fast. Still drew a card. Why did I get a chance to frost flash freeze there? Fuck me. Just got destroyed. I just have to get a creature on the board here. Sounds of the wilds. Bad shape here. I don't think this helps me on this turn, right? I think it needs to be on their turn to basically buy me time. I think I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is Hunter after this. So wait and see what he does. Then I'm going to cast Hunter. Then I'll go for the attack round with this. If you want excitement, you got to leave the city. It's a 7 6 elusive. Feels bad. Targeted by anything, you think? I sharp is my spear. The hunt is on. Gift from the river folk. Yeah, 100% flash freeze on his turn. I can't attack with the elusive creature. Or, oh, it's not elusive. I thought this guy was elusive. Oh, well, fuck then. I can't even block the seven. Okay. Swing quickly, little fish. I've been waiting for this. Okay. Pretty unexcited by these news. This news here. You call that sneaky? Get out of here. Hey, skeezy. Alright, 
so this is my only removal for the 7-4. So presumably he tries to kill me here. I got here first. And we say no to dying. Discover the unknown. He draws a card off that annoyingly. Alright. Got <laughs> really clunky hand here, right? I need one more mana, this becomes a 6-6. Six, six. One more card, this becomes a 7-7, seven, seven, I think. That's what I want to do with this shit. It's probably still this and this. Got some big ass dudes here in the end here. Oh, it triggers even when it's on the board. Oh, okay. Well, that's a lot less bad than I thought it was. So I guess I'm just swinging here. Time for violence. I assumed that it was on cast only that that effect took into place. Maybe I should have played more first. Okay, that, that one seems like a bad block, right? Because I first strike kill it. It's so weird he wants to block this too. I guess he's got tricks, the only thing that makes any sense. Like why else would he block this? Stun once it's already in play. Weird. And it unsummons it? Like, no, it's just there. Okay. It's just stun this round. Tenacity through trial. Alright, so we've got 10 mana. I'm at 2, so all of his attackers are lethal, and this thing is fearsome. He's got an elusive attacker. I have to get an elusive blocker down, so it's got to be this and something, presumably these two. And burn. Although maybe that was better as a four mana. It's just not very mana efficient. That replacement effect not really working as I intended it to was pretty bad news for us. It's really thrown off the rest of the game. Yeah, I know what fearsome is. It's elusive, that's the issue though. It's over here. The value Yeti turn? So this is not an instant, right? So I, I don't know when the value Yeti turn was. Remember your training.
aren't you? Got a lot of cards in his hand. He didn't have any instants last time. He had five mana. So these are presumably creatures. Hardened scales. Is that not is that permanent? I just assumed that was till the end of the turn. I guess it might be permanent. So it's full mana efficiency for us. We're out of cards in hand. The board is somewhat stable. We're going to die to these fucking mushrooms, right? I can't tell how many mushrooms I have affecting me right now. Cards left 14, 10 puff cups. So 10 out of my 14 cards do one damage to me. That sounds pretty bad. Okay. Pretty good card for us. You're all over the balance. Good top deck. Destiny waits. When you stun or recall an enemy, strike it. Is a leaf's only purpose to fall. I don't know what this card does. It's presumably he drew his fucking champion finally. We have to attack though, right? So it doesn't really matter. When you stun or recall an enemy, strike it. I strike it. Does that mean they fight it? All right. Six, six. Eats. Five, four, five. Four, six. This might hurt you. Eats random one, two. Seven, seven. Eats one, one. Six, five. Eats begins. one, two. Attack. Do I have Overwhelm somewhere? Oh, I did have Overwhelm. My sweet button. Hmm. Yep, I didn't realize that card had Overwhelm. That would have been much better, because I would have got some damage to his face in a, in a place where we're really close to killing him. So... That feels bad, and that might have been part of it. I want this card, right? Gold card sees me big. When I'm summoned, frostbite enemies with three or less health. How does this save me big damage? How does this stun him? Ah. Gotta trust your instincts. Because it gives me a fucking card. I'm always up for a round or two. All 
that glitters. I think I still play this. I want to attack with it next turn before he gets options to change the board. Do I have that taunting wolf anymore? I think I want to attack with that. Maybe I do. What's the damage like? So he blocks that and that. Those are the two biggest damage dealers. He takes 11, 13. He's really close. I think we are attacking with that. This might have even been worth playing this. Except I can't have more than six on the board, right? So. Yeah, it's the math I just did on here. If we had done that trample damage, we would have won this, right? Hover the eye. Uh huh. I alone decide my fate. Did you die from this? No, the risks. Easy game! When you just have four, 10 of your 14 cards you kill you, just don't draw them. That was fun. That was really fun. Oh no. Okay. I'm so confused. Why am I now in a picking screen? Hey Leo, two days now. When you win, you get to pick more cards. All right. Do you want damage to all enemies in the enemy nexus? Revive me transformed into Egniva. Level up your enlightened. Uh, this is multiplayer at the moment that we're playing, Leo. So I hadn't seen that poison mechanic before, which kills me for drawing cards. I kind of would like to play this card again. Like another round of these. It seems okay. The Yeti was slow. Yeah, we're going to take this. Good talk. All right. 1-0. and oh. Continue. All right, so we missed a couple interactions there. The un the the replacement effect still got unsummoned, which was kind of weird. And we missed the trample attack where we were setting up where we actually really needed to push for damage. So that was pretty bad news for that. I'm not sure if there are any other major mistakes. Apparently, I missed a frost attack. I missed a frost turn or something where that would have been good. All right, it's at arena, right? All right, five mana. It's a lot. Two mana makes it cheaper. Don't really want that. Don't really want that right now. Okay. I could have prevented 11 damage yet. So I did mention that I missed that. I don't really need to fucking point it out again, but thanks for that. All right, opponent going first again, is that right? No, I went first. Ban this. Take a little, Smell little strong. What is this? Two three at what? Jesus, two three. Could just block it, I guess. This land is ours. Wanted to get this guy down and start reducing the cost. Didn't do anything. 
the narwhal. What does it do again? It's elusive, and if I can make... Oh, no, he can make me block with it. I think I'm just swinging with this guy. Before creatures. But if I do that... I guess it's elusive. I guess not. Alright. Cast our golden narwhal. Looking for trouble? It found you. Fuck. The winter's claw. It's okay. It feels kind of bad. We have an answer. What is our answer for? Stomach this force her to block, you're saying? Okay. So we cast this on our turn then. Seems like a way to trap him too. If he taunts this, we replace it. at 2-4. Uh, I think I block that, right? I take 3 damage blocking it and only do 1 back to it. I still think I block it. Got four mana. Could just play the two two. Four mana is a little clunky. Another elusive damage dealer, I guess. All right, so our round we're gonna frostbite the three three, right? Oh, we don't have an attacker that deals three damage anymore. Five mana. I'll hunt them where they breed. Do they get a do they get priority in between my attacks here or no? Fortune makes it rain. It's annoying. So I can now attack with this, force the 3 3 to block. Or I can attack. Okay. The hunt is on. So unfortunately he duplicated it and got another one into his deck. Plus two plus one, it still dies. It's fucking fine. Why am I not getting priority to do something like... Oh, because I'm at two mana. Okay. I will play my part. He's not elusive, is it? Fuck, it's elusive. Fuck! I'm like, ah, we got on a... Okay. That's pretty bad news. Small mistakes, chat. Small losses. Shadow. 
First might give priority, but I don't have three mana. So that's six here. the bounty board today. So I'm going to take a million this round. Is that good enough? TF red card. What is TF? Twisted Fate? Okay. I don't know what these abilities are. Red card? Seems like a not bad one, huh? Good call. I gotta read the rest of her abilities so I know what the fuck it does. I was gonna summon her last so she didn't die, but this kills a lot of their stuff. Thank you, chat. That was very helpful. It doesn't kill this 2-1, but other than that, it kills a lot. That's such a good play, too. <laughs> Thanks, chat. Well, let's save my chat. In a card game. First time, chat. It's good. Hesitation's a tell. Says I don't share. Seems like not bad for me. You point, I shoot. It's strike is attack or defend, right? Card is just like a two three, right? Can't block an elusive unit. I see. I see you there. Okay. Quick tax only, yeah, but strike is whenever, right? Could I also have caught in the cold at it? During there, even though it's a slow spell, probably not. It had to have been fast, right? <laughs> 